<laughs> We're standing in a place called Wonderland. It's actually kind of an outdoor installation, a museum of curiosities that are all recycled or contributed by the community. People leave things in the driveway and then they come back to see how I've put them together. It's kind of a collaboration. This has been a way for me to interact with people. A picnic set for squirrels. <laughs> Being out here and working, feeling like I'm creating art. You know, you never know what all of your neighbors really think. <laughs> and I'm sure that after I'm gone, there'll be a, a sound of a junk truck backing up. But they've been real tolerant. I'd sort of call it an amalgam of chaos and color, but it's beautiful in a sense. <laughs> it's had a calming effect on the neighborhood. So I thought if I make this wonderland and people take the time to look at it, maybe there is someone who reads the sign that says don't give up. Or maybe there's somebody who sees the sign that says inspire someone or to take the high road. I found a way to make things out of other stuff that people throw away and bring joy to people. You can't help but come by and just smile, right? This is where the magic happens. This is the Verkstad workshop, which means workshop in Swedish. You never know what people will bring. An alligator having a tussle with a doll. If they want to see dinosaurs wrestling with dolls and chomping on their legs and hands, I build it. What is beauty? And the notion of believing women, that's a pretty big message of mine. I really believe that your happiness can come from making other people happier. And I'm working on that. Because sometimes you can't find it in yourself. You can only find it when you give it away. Everybody get together, try to love one another right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm.